Miss Miami entrepreneur likens her invention to a Swiss Army knife for moms. Susie Taylor says she created her multitasking super bib after constantly doing loads of laundry after plenty of spit ups and spills with traditional bibs. And I just kept buying them. And it got to a point where I realized I was spending money on products that didn't work because I thought maybe one of them would work. Susie says she had her light bulb moment during a plane trip with her husband and two little ones. By the end of the trip, the kids had been crawling over mom and dad and spilling stuff everywhere. By the end of the flight, everyone was a mess, except for her husband, whose special golf shirt was clean. And yes, the kids were jumping on dad too. He had some spit up on him from Mason, from my little one, and I took a wipe and I wiped it off. And the idea of why are you wiping off when we're stuck in these cotton, gross, plasticky things, you know? And that started the ball rolling. Susie took it upon herself to find out what materials were in that golf shirt and why it could be so easily cleaned with the touch of a wipe. I became an investigator. I tried to find fabric that would do what his did, but it would dry instantly, it wouldn't actually stain, and it wouldn't hold an odor. After many late nights sifting through information, she had her answer and her idea for a product she would create. A bib that would repel spills and stains like her husband's golf shirt. But this product would be much more than a simple baby bib. It would be a super bib, specifically engineered to be used not only as a bib, but as a breastfeeding cover, a blanket, an art smock, a placemat, and cooking apron all rolled up into one. And then I came up with this design that was really simple that my child didn't really think it was a bib. It was just a shirt. And it just happened to flip fit over his head and through his arms. And it was so simple, but nobody had come up with it. It's called Bibby Tech. With her idea underway, Susie entered a business challenge for the Miami Herald, where she placed second in the competition. With plenty of support behind her, she decided to patent the idea and go forward. Well, it's a poly nylon blend, and it's backed with a fleece, and it has a special component that's non-toxic and eco-friendly, and it's certified by OECOTEC standard, meaning there's no lead or toxins in the product, and there's no lead or toxins in the ground after the product's made. As you can see from this demonstration, sticky maple syrup can be poured on and easily wiped up in a flash. The company has become a family affair, with her husband, sister, and other family members all taking roles within Bibitech, which is run out of this Miami warehouse. And while Susie says it can be tough at times to juggle two small children while being a wife and president of her growing company, she says she set her priorities long ago, and that has kept her focused. I'm a mom first before anything, and if this company is going to go anywhere, it's going to go inside my world, which is mom.